name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is why does the moon reflect red sometimes? So to correct the question a little bit is why does the moon appear red sometimes? And uh, it's kind of the same effect as why the sunset looks reddish. So let's talk about what's happening uh, in the atmosphere and why near the horizon we have this effect where we see a lot of red scattering. So if we have the Earth's surface and then we have the atmosphere, we're standing over here, and here we're looking at the moon, let's say somewhere over here. So as you can tell, if we were to look up, we would see a lot less of the atmospheric effect. But if we look at it from here, we have to travel further in the atmosphere. So what's happening in the atmosphere and why are things being scattered away? So there, in the atmosphere, we get something called the Rayleigh scattering. And this effect uh, goes as, is proportional to the wavelength to the fourth power. If this number is very small, the probability of getting scattered is very high. And if this number is very high, the probability of getting scattered is very small. Now blue uh, is a very uh, short wavelength, therefore blue has a higher probability of getting scattered in the atmosphere. So when you have the light, blue will scatter away and you will only be left over, uh, left with this reddish, uh, the red side of the spectrum, so with the red wavelengths. And that's why it appears red. It means that by the time that you're actually seeing the moon, all the blue has been scattered away and what you're now seeing is what's left over and those are the red wavelengths. My name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is why the moon appears red.